Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. As you guys can see by the thumbnail and the title, today's video is going to be a Valentine's Day look book is style look which is my second style look book on my channel the first one that was uploaded before this one if y'all haven't checked it out go check it out and make sure you leave the description box below so i'm going to be putting some fits together some valentine day inspired fits real classy real grown real sexy or whatnot and for the valentine's day season we're well, not season but the valentine's day holiday i guess you know i don't know need hair makeup accessories just everything shoes everything's going to come in clutch in this video i got a lot of fits for y'all okay and um i am testing out my camera today this is my first time using my camera for a haul and yeah i just want to try something different something refreshing something a more professional looking so if it don't come out right i'm sorry for the quality but if you do then let me know down in the comment box below which one y'all prefer either my phone or my camera because your girl trying something new okay but um that's enough for the intro i'm probably rambling on way. before we get into this video make sure you leave a like on this video and subscribe to my channel make sure you turn the post notifications you guys never miss any more uploads and before we get into the video let's take a look at this outfit though like it's the fit for me yeah so anyways we're gonna get straight into the video okay so we starting off we starting off pretty fine we start off freaking spicy okay so first look we have here is so freaking cute it's very extra i feel like it's really really elegant really 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 really, really sexy and grown i feel like so basically i have this leopard um versace inspired satin top and it is oversized, but I was trying to tuck it into the skater skirt. And I just have this black plain skater skirt, and I just have some black knee-high boots, the same boots that were in my intro. And then, of course, I had to do the red lip, because the red lip is just giving very sexy, very Valentine's Day holiday inspired. And I just have this material um, clutch. And I got this top from Pretty Little Thing. In this video, I make sure, like, I do all my other uh, fashion and hauls and stuff like that. I do make sure to include everything that I wore in the video down in the description box below. If you guys are interested in these products, the size, the price, everything like that, direct links, and everything will be mentioned in the description box below. Uh, this black skirt, I honestly don't know where I got this from, but you can literally find a black skater skirt anywhere. Shein has a lot of different black skater skirts. You can find a black skater skirt here um, near my clothing store in your hometown or your um neighborhood or whatever and then these black knee-high boots i got from um just fab they were ten dollars for the vip thing and i made sure to leave them down in the description box below they just have like some little tassels at the end i feel like it kind of really gives it very much flavor or spice to the look and then this bag i got from a store called these discounts out here in memphis i got this about two years ago so i'm pretty sure they don't have it anymore but i just think it's really cute you know it's giving what it's supposed to give it's giving Sexy is giving grown woman. Okay, three layer necklace. <laughs> I grabbed a rose. <laughs> it's giving spicy. Like <laughs> this is a little um uh, a prop that I'm using for my shoot. Valentine's Day shoot. Yeah. Well, yeah. This is so cute though. Just imagine somebody give me some flowers. Like oh my god, they're so beautiful. <sighs> And if y'all know, y'all know, I love my shades. So, I would definitely pair these black retro type shades with it. I just love the black tint and the stones and the diamonds. Goes perfectly with this bag. And it's just giving you very much date night. Nighttime. And I got these from Shein. They were like $5. Okay, so this next fit we have is something a little bit more simpler. If you are more of a simple girl or whatever. I have this white um, oversized sweater i got this black corset i got this from amazon it was about 10 15 dollars then i just got on some black biker shorts and then i just got on the same black knee high boots as mentioned in the last clip and then i just got this little mini black satchel bag i got this from Shein as well and then i decided to keep these gold necklaces on because i feel like it also brings out the look as well it feels like the corset belt really does the outfit justice as well and it also give give you kind of like a little shape you know and I just wanted to make sure that I include different kind of fits for y'all. Some more casual, some more dressier, some more fancier, some more simpler. Because, you know, we all have different styles and stuff like that. So, let me know what you guys think about this and if you would wear this or not. Okay, so the next fit we have probably has to be one of my favorites. Y'all, I am freaking loving this fit. Oh my God, I love it a lot. So, basically... Y'all know I had to come through with the 90s inspired look. Y'all know. If y'all know, y'all know. 90s my is favorite, my favorite decade. Y'all didn't know. So, a leopard pinafore slit dress. So, here it goes. Very tight fitted. 
me show y'all how it looks. Really, really sexy. Goes very, very well with this red lip. And it was on Shein for literally only $6. So, yeah, if y'all know, y'all know. And I just paired it with this black bodysuit. And this just like a regular crew neck bodysuit. I'm not gonna lie, I actually definitely would prefer a, uh, a turtleneck bodysuit instead because I feel like it'll really like feel this part of my body in. But I don't have a black bodysuit, a black turtleneck bodysuit. So I just have to go with this. For the sake of the video, but it still looks like, very good as well. This is definitely giving spicy. It's giving spicy. It's giving like I don't got a man, but I'm still taking myself out and treat myself. You know, that's what it's giving. So I love this a lot. Then also I paired these black shades with it. Some black um thin shades. Y'all know these were definitely very popular in the 90s. And also I decided to add these gold thick hoops as well because it's giving vintage but classy and i just love it if y'all don't follow me on instagram y'all need to follow me on instagram at styles by Corsha because that's where all of my looks be at period and don't forget to comment down in the comment box below which outfit is your favorite which one would you wear for a date night on valentine's day if you have a date and even if you don't just let me know which outfit was your favorite I mean, like if SWV or TLC or somebody dressed up or like Brandy or somebody dressed up in the 90s, this is what they'll wear, I feel like. So period. Switch up though. It's the switch up for me. <laughs> this one probably be a little bit more riskier than the other ones. And that's just because the dress is extremely short. But I just know somebody, somebody about their life. Somebody will wear this hell. Okay, maybe just me. But this is really, really cute. It's giving more daytime Valentine's Day. So if it's like you type person, you want to be cute all day long. Casual. But it's also giving me business like as well. I threw the glasses and I still got the red lips. So it's giving you casual, you know, sexy too. Basically, I just have this uh, white tank top dress. Then I just got this jacket from Pretty Little Thing. Yeah, I've had this jacket for literally years. Probably like about four years now. So actually, I got it from Miss Guy and not Pretty Little Thing. have these very cute tennis shoes these are some steve madden shoes and i think they're called blush pink artsy or something like that i'm not really sure but they just have this color pink in it and they have white black and gray as well you guys can see the true detail and having the jacket off the shoulder really does add a style because you could just do it like this but no who wants to be like that who wants to be born when you can just have it off the shoulder a little bit just kind of so freaking in love with this y'all this definitely gives me a vibe that the other ones do not and i am loving every single bit of it it's giving me very much um rich <laughs> look at that it's giving me rich i got this mustard yellow off the shoulder wrap dress from shein so freaking cute i love the detail and i look like a little slit in the middle then it comes with this belt and it kind of gives y'all a waist a little bit of a snatch and it just shows you a little bit of cleavage. So if you're not about that life, which I'm honestly not, you would just pull it up and then it won't really be off the shoulders as much. And then you also have some of your cleavage as well. And then I just paired it with this um, multicolor snake print bag. And, and it has gold hardware. So I matched it with this um, gold rhinestone necklace. And then I just have these beautiful shoes on. I love these shoes. I've had these shoes about two years now. They're gold. And then I just have like the rhinestones on the strap part. And it goes perfect with my rhinestone necklace. And then I just got my red lip, of course. So... Definitely for fits like this, I like to wear, I like to uh, wear like accessories, like certain bags that have like multi multiple colors in it, just so it can like really bring the outfit together. But I'm really loving this. Hope y'all can't see my toes because they are not done. <laughs> I'm trying to pose and my toes is not done, baby. This and it's so freaking cute. It's very extra, very, very much me. And I think this is probably one of my favorites. Um, it's given 90s and it's also given very chicy and also very classy. And it's just given a mixture of everything. And it's actually like a lot going on. But I like it though. You know, this is for my more extra girls. You know, my girls that like to do full blown. Okay. So I have this turtleneck crop top, white crop top. It is long sleeve, by the way, as well. I got this from Shein and then I just have on the black um biker jacket and then i just have these boyfriend distressed um high waisted jeans i got these from fashion nova and then i just have on the same pink heels and then i just have on a gold waist chain belt it looks a lot like the the silver one i had on and i just have this pink clutch and also the black shade that i had on in some of the other clips as well and i also have on the gold necklace
So this next fit we have is very, very cute and it's really simple as well. So I have this white um plunge neck mini bodycon dress and it's just ripped. It has like little grip lines. If you guys can't see the true detail, then I just have this black leather model jacket. I got this dress from Pretty Little Thing a couple of years ago, and it was like $6 at the time. And then I just matched it with this uh, pink clutch. It's the same as that color that it's in my um that is in my shoes. So this thing to where I definitely prefer just throw on a white dress or a black dress and just throw on a cute jacket and it'll really just be really, really cute. Throw on some cute shoes that has like different colors in it and give you a cute bag that'll match the shoes and you got a fire look, period. And you don't have to do too much at all. So they're playing like a lot of music and you're just at a bar or something. I could definitely see myself wearing something like this. Dress makes the body look really, really good. Okay, period. This chart may be familiar because I did have this on in my last video, my lovely wholesale um, style lookbook that I did in the last video. And I just said that this would be perfect for Valentine's Day, so I just decided to style it in this outfit. So I have this chart on, and then I just have on these jeans that I got from Shein, you guys. have like some little rips at the knees, really, really cute, definitely give it casual and definitely dressy as well. Then I just decided to pair it with these pink heels right here. Y'all, I can't walk in heels, so I'm just doing this for the video. Hopefully, I don't bust my because that would be a that wouldn't be good <laughs> i just have these little chunky black, um pink heels the pink bag that i got in my hand this was also in the last uh clip as well with the other outfit this little um this waist chain belt accessory this definitely spices up the look like this is so cute I love the wash. The wash goes perfect with this um, top. Not as dressy as the other ones are. It's a little bit more on the casual side. And basically, I just have this um, pink toned nude um, square neck dress. And it's a bodycon mini dress. It goes down to my knees, as you guys can see. And then I just have, and I got this from Shein, by the way. And I think this dress was like nine dollars i want to say but i got this dress like two years ago so i try to find it on the site if i can if i can't i'll try to find like a replica or a dupe for it and then this jacket i've had to check it for literally years y'all for literally about four three four years now so i don't know if i can find it but i did get it from fashion nova and it's just like a little rip it's literally distressed all over this is the most distressed jacket that i own kind of spices a little the, the outfit up just a little bit because it's the, like very distressed just so the outfit won't be really, really that plain. Light wash and it just has like some um, brown contrast stitching throughout the whole thing. Thought it would be really cute with the with this dress. And then I just have these very casual little slides, y'all. This I just I just really really didn't want to do too much with this fit. I just feel like you know this is something more casual, more simple. You don't have to wear heels with this a neutral tone snake print bag, and I just think it goes perfect with this. You know. It's the best material dress that I own, honestly, because I do have more colors as well. But I like this, and then you just have like your hand in your pockets. In it. Okay, so this one, this is the second to the last one. So I have one more left. I know this is probably like a long video, but I'm in certain looks, okay, very. But, anyways, this is definitely one of my favorites. One of my favorites. Come on now, like this is a freaking vibe. This is a whole vibe like what i keep looking at myself because i just look so freaking good it's simple but the details really pop it off i got this white satin or silk um button up top and i just got it tucked in these fashion over jeans these are some distressed light washed um high waisted red bag right here and it has a gold chain this little mini satchel bag and then i have this gold belt right here the same belt, the same gold belt that I had on in the other video, what well, in the other clip. And I also have on my gold chains again or whatever, you know, if you're going to like a club type of uh, setting or if you're going to more like a dinner, uh, brunch, breakfast. Like it's just really, really cute for any occasion. Well, not occasion, but any like time of the day, as I should say. You can change the red lip and you can do another color lip or you can change the heels and do another color heel. Whatever you decide to do, this is just like some inspiration. It's so cute, like serving looks. Okay, period. When this, when the outfit is simple like this, like you just have a plain white top on and jeans, that's the perfect time for you to be able to 
throw some accessories with it so that it can really bring the look together oh uh, gold accessories and gold necklaces and gold belts and stuff it really spices the look up you guys probably my second favorite the last one that i have to show y'all is definitely going to be my first favorite y'all already know fashion nova jeans does the butt really much justice okay y'all so i definitely say the best for last this is definitely my favorite one i know i was saying which one was my favorite one but this one is definitely my favorite this is literally me if you know me then you know this is literally me with the tennis shoes with the white rose socks and then you can do something extremely dressy as well so this is definitely me y'all i'm actually wearing this on valentine's day that's why i decided to save it for last because it's my favorite one period I'm dying to do a satin dress with some some jordan ones look for a long time and i finally been able to do it and i got this dress from shein it was like 17 dollars, and i just got the black red white black red and white um jordan ones i'm not sure exactly which ones they are i just know they some ones <laughs> and then i got on some white rose socks which is my favorite accessory to where i love me some white rose socks y'all for real for real and then i just got this bag right here the same bag that i had in a couple of the other fits from earlier the black bag with the um silver chains and then i just paired it with my silver hold on yeah my silver necklace Two layer necklace from Shein as well. This is yeah, I posted this exact outfit on my um on my IG story the other day because I was like doing like a little just like trying on my different clothes or whatever like that and everyone was in love with this dress, y'all. But as usual, I don't like to say where I got something from until I do with my video. So if you was one of those people, I got it from Shein. It ruches on the side. I love ruched uh ruched um dresses because it really accentuates the um you know the body a little bit kind of gives you a little bit more booty so i love it a lot where you like to wear a lot of um heels and stuff you could definitely do some heels with this and i just love the neck part right here the cow neck but yeah so that is the last fit for this video you guys i'll see you guys in the outro all right you guys so that does conclude today's video i hope you guys enjoyed this video also make sure to leave down in the comment box below what was your favorite fit what was your favorite item and also let me know if y'all gonna be celebrating valentine's day this year because i know i'm not but it's cool though. It's cool because I'll be serving looks at home, taking me some pictures, um, spoiling myself. Okay, period. It's now 8 o'clock in the morning. I've been recording this video for the past five hours now. And I'm extremely, extremely tired. So I'm ready to go to sleep and I'm just ready to go to sleep, okay? So leave a like on this video and subscribe to my channel. And turn on your post notifications because you guys never miss any more uploads. And also before you leave from my channel or leave from this video make sure to leave down in the comment box below which outfit was your favorite which fit was your favorite i love you guys so much and thanks for watching i'll see you guys in the next one